enters into the home of this family, recognizes that this child is grieving and in distress. Something is wrong. He's not doing well. And as busy as the Prophet is, and as so much is happening in the Ummah and taking care of all the matters of the Ummah, he still recognizes what's happening with this child. And then he asks the people of the household, what's wrong with the child? And so they tell him. And then the Prophet, our beloved, وسلم, approaches the child with so much gentleness and asks the child in a very beautiful hadith. Do you know this hadith that I'm referring to? This companion, this Sahabi, he was very young, but we still call him a Sahabi because he lived, he was a contemporary of the Prophet وسلم, he lived in the same time period, but he was a child. And in this narration, we learn that his name is Aba Umaid. And the Prophet وسلم, goes to him and says, Ya Aba Umaid, O Aba Umaid, ma fa'ala al-Nughayr? What did the Nughayr do? And the Nughayr, if you can listen to the name Umaid and Nughayr, you see that they're rhyming. And you also understand that the Prophet وسلم, in his eloquence is able to take, subhanAllah, right there on the spot, take the name of the boy, rhyme it with the name of a little bird. He had learned that the boy had lost his pet bird. And that's why he was so sad and upset. And he clearly showed it. And when the Prophet heard this from the family members, he didn't just dismiss it and go, oh, it's just a pet. Moving on. No, he actually was tuned into the child and was able to what? go to him and look at how he actually asked the question. He asked him, oh, Abba Umayr, what did the nulayr, what did the bird do? Not what did you do to the bird, <laughs> right? And so, and nor did he dismiss it, and nor did he belittle it, nor did he minimize it, nor did he blame him. And this is really important when we talk about children, and we talk about their emotions, and we talk about how they're doing, and being tuned in with them. Validation is what we saw the Prophet وسلم, do in his hadith, and his interaction with Abu Umayr, where he validated him without blaming he essentially, in the, in the question and the way he asked it, there was a validation in that this is okay. It's not your fault. Hence, he's using, what did the bird do? And not, what did you do to the bird? 